We are at home cooking with Miss Brenda D. So welcome from Miss Brenda D. And our family. Hello, everyone. How y'all doing on this nice, beautiful day? Today, we're making delicious Kool-Aid pies, y'all. Yes, and here are our ingredients. I'm going to show y'all two different types. One with cream cheese and the other with condensed milk. Okay, y'all, let's get to making our Kool-Aid pies. Here I'm showing you our ingredients. We have the lemon-lime Kool-Aid. A graham cracker crust, powdered sugar, cream cheese, whipped topping, and vanilla extract. Y'all, those are our only ingredients. Here I'm showing you, I'm cutting up our room temperature cream cheese. Cutting up your cream cheese make it more easier to mix in with your other ingredients. Now it's time to mix in all our ingredients. In this bowl, I have placed in our cream cheese, and I'm gonna break it up a little bit. Like I say, this will help it to mix in with the rest of our ingredients. Now our powdered sugar. and our lemon lime Kool-Aid. This recipe calls for two packages. Y'all, this gives the a pie a tart flavor. And y'all, the kids love this uh, Kool-Aid pie because of the tartness. But if you wanna use just one packet, make this recipe yours. And here we're adding our vanilla extract. And now we're mixing these ingredients together. Make sure you to get all down at the bottom. If you can't, uh, you can always use a spatula to make sure that you get all the powdered sugar at the bottom. Here I'm, I'm using my spatula to get to the bottom of the bowl so that everything is mixed in well. And we're going to continue to mix. Here we're using like eight ounces of this whipped topping. I'm using a large container. This, this is for if you're going to make two pies you can use this one container all we're using from this container is eight ounces per pie so mix in eight ounces of your whipped topping here we're mixing this in we're gonna well we go, i'm gonna say it like this we're folding it in at first Fold in your whipped topping, and as you begin to fold, it becomes thicker. As y'all can see, it's becoming thicker. But we want to continue to mix because we want all our ingredients mixed in well. Okay, just keep on mixing. The more you mix, the more smoother your filling will become. Okay, I'm gonna to continue to mix this and I'm gonna be right back. Okay, our 
filling has been mixed well, y'all. And it is so smooth and creamy. And this is what we're looking for. And we're placing it into our graham cracker crust. What I do, I place it in the middle and then I work my way to the sides and make sure you get the sides really good because we don't want any holes in it. So make sure you press down some to make sure there is no air holes. Okay, we're going to continue to spread this around. Spread it as evenly as you can and um, as we want it to look really pretty, you know, presentation means a lot and so if you're taking it somewhere or you just want to just serve it to your family you want it to look you know good and so just spread it around and this is evenly like i said as evenly as you can until you get all the sides uh uh spread it around there and um like i said no air holes and yeah and then you're good to go Okay, this is what we're looking for. And we're going to cover. It comes with this little thin clear cover. Place it in the refrigerator until you're ready to serve. Here I'm showing you a different recipe using condensed milk. Here we're pouring our condensed milk into our bowl. Now we're pouring in our packet of Kool-Aid. We are only using one packet per pie. And we're mixing this in. The more you mix, the more the color will come through. Just keep mixing. As you see, it, the color is forming. Okay, this is what we're looking for. Let's go to the next step. Here we're placing in our Cool Whip. And we're folding this in. And we're going to keep on folding. Y'all, this recipe is so easy that a child can do it. Because uh, this is so easy. This is something that you can get your grandkids or your children uh, in to help you with. And they don't mind stirring and folding in. And this is, will be something good for them, you know, just to keep them busy. And I'm sure they will enjoy it because this is something that they made, you know. So, you know, this is something good for them to make during the holidays or uh, during the summertime, you know, whenever uh, you want to. It, and the ingredients are so simple. And so... Just get your ingredients together and call in your grandkids or your children or whatever to come and help you make this. And y'all will have a wonderful, wonderful time making it. As y'all can see, it's all coming together. The color is coming in. And I just love these pies because they are so creamy and smooth and they taste so, so good. Y'all can make these as fundraisers. You know, get your orders in and 
as fundraisers. Y'all can, you know, you can earn money doing them. And the kids can help you do it. And that's what I enjoy. The kids help in making these. I had my grandson, Jayton, in the kitchen helping me. Uh, and he was waiting on the bowl and the spatula, y'all. He's one of my older grandsons. And he was there helping with the dishes. And so um, he was in there. He saw how easy they were made. I'm hoping he will take this to their church. They don't live in the same city as I do. Uh, maybe he can take it to their church and, you know, present it to them as a fundraiser, you know, and go from there. Here I'm placing our filling into our graham cracker crust. And now I'm spreading it as evenly as I can. Make sure you spread, like I say, around the edges. Make sure the edges are all filled in. And I'm going to finish spreading this around and I'm going to be back with the final result. Okay, y'all, I am back. I'm showing y'all our end result of our pie. Um, I made like two more pies that I did not show y'all how I made, but the other two that I made, I'm making it with the Kool-Aid and the condensed milk recipe as well. Uh, so um, I found out that the, the one with the cream cheese is more thicker it, it's, it's a little bit slight thicker than the one, you know, with the condensed milk, but they all are so, so delicious. Okay, I hope y'all enjoy this recipe. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel, and please don't forget to hit that notification bell to get our new and upcoming videos. And to all our new viewers and subscribers, you are welcome, welcome, welcome to our channel. Okay, y'all. I hope y'all enjoyed cooking with me as much as I always enjoy cooking with you all. As always, I'm going to say, y'all have a blessed day and bye-bye for now. Love y'all. Stay safe and be blessed. My words of encouragement today, always remember when life throws you lemons, make lemonade and enjoy your big tall glass of lemonade. Be blessed, y'all. We are at home cooking with Miss Brenda D. So welcome from Miss Brenda D. and our family. That's a hit!